we are back, and we are Toby Cat Crew. And we are doing the Rumble Showcase. Yep, on our uh, starter game, One Piece Legendary. I know this is very exciting. Rumble is one of my favorite fruits. I don't know and if you guys know that. And thanks to Gonzo for yes, providing special, us with this account. Special, special thanks to Gonzo. He's right here on his alt. He let us use his main account to actually showcase this uh, Rumble fruit. So thank you so much to Gonzo. Um, we really appreciate it. And, um, yeah, so we're just going to get right into it because we're so excited to finally do this uh, showcase. So this account is actually um, a legendary account, so there's two fruits on this. But we're just going to focus on the Rumble Fruit right now, which is right here. So Rumble Fruit has four moves, like four main moves, which is um, Rumble Staff, Althor, Lightning Blitz, and Overlord. Or Overload. Sorry, not Overlord. <laughs> Yay anime, right? Yeah. But um, anyway, so we're just going to go through each of these moves. So the first move is Rumble Staff, which requires 100 sword, and you click Z. And it brings so, out like a sword, kind yep, of? Yep, so I'm going to click Z, and it brings out this really kind of cool staff. Oh yeah, one more thing before that. It is yeah. a Logia fruit. Right, right? I mean, yeah. So, I mean, you can see the magma from here, but um, just normally it's a, a Logia, like he said. And then with Hockey, too, you can hit other people. Um, do you know with Rumble, can you hit other Logias without hockey? Uh, yes, you can. Okay, so that's important to know. And with the Rumble Staff, too, you can keep this out while you do all your other moves. And what does it look like with hockey on it? With hockey, uh, you, like that. Wow, that's so cool. So this is what it looks like with hockey. So cool. Anyway, so I'm going to turn off hockey for the next move. Turn now, off my staff, too. Turn off my staff, okay. So to... Take out, take out your staff, you click Z, and to put it back, you also click Z. And so, you can use all these moves with the staff. Level. Right. So, the next move is Althor. Now, I'm going to show you two... So, Althor looks differently depending on what you do. So, if you just click it, or just, like, spam it, so, like, click it once, it looks like a little beam like this. And it goes really far, actually. It's got amazing range. And it stuns a little bit. You can see here as I'm hitting. Yeah, it, it shocks you. It a little shocks bit. them and it keeps them from moving. So that's what just clicking Althor does. Now, if you press and hold Althor and charge it up, you can see this bar right here is actually increasing. And um, you can charge it up all the way to the top. And I'm actually going to aim right here. And it goes wherever your mouse is, just similar to what I just showed you. You release. And a giant thundercloud comes out from the sky and completely destroys everyone. So that's Elthor. Let's so see what it looks like with hockey now. With hockey, yeah. That looks amazing. Don't hit me so either. I'm going to... I'm not going to charge it up nearly as much, but with hockey, it looks about the same, just it does a ton more damage and kills basically everything. Yeah. So that's what it looks like with hockey. Now the third move is lightning blitz. Now... Similar to Althor, it's different whether you just spam it or charge it. If you spam it, it does a little attack. Yeah, if you spam it, it does, like, cool lightning bolts like this. It doesn't shock people or anything. No, so either. unlike Althor, where it shocks people, this doesn't have any have a certain status effect. And um, I don't know if you noticed, but it's kind of sensitive to where your mouse is. You have to really be aiming at the person for it to hit, and it doesn't do a ton of damage. But what you want to use with Lightning Blitz is um, you press and hold C and you charge it up. And if it's 90% or more, you're actually going to teleport. So I'm just going to kind of go over here. So I'm still holding C, which is the move. I'm going to put my mouse over here. And I'm actually going to teleport to where my mouse is. It's a very far teleport. It's it a lot is, farther than Shave. Yeah, it's a very far teleport. They have a cool effect for Shave too, though. Yeah, so... I can go really far. Now, normal shave, it goes about the same distance, and you get those cool little lightning effects behind you. But, I mean, this teleport is insane. It can go across islands. Now, I'm not going to do that right now, but you're, you'll just have to trust me on that. But yeah, so that is what um, Lightning Blitz does. Now, the last move is Overload, which oh. takes 100 defense this right here. a bunch of damage over time. Yeah, so this one, you have to be pretty close to people. You just press, and it does damage over time. All right, let's see it with hockey, though. And then with hockey, I'm going to do it again. Not to me. Not to you? No. Nope. All right, I'll do, it. I'll do it to Gonzo's alt. 
and it does double the damage. It looks the same, though. It looks the same, though. So the only thing that really changes with hockey is the staff. But, I mean, obviously, that's only the looks that change. Um, the defense changes – or not the defense, the uh, – the attack amount also increases with everything with hockey. So, um, I think that's it for the Rumble Fruit. It's got these four moves, which are amazing. And then um, you just got to... So, overlo- Overload, you cannot press and hold. Like, I'm pressing and holding B, and it does it immediately. But the other two moves, depending on whether you press and hold or just spam with a click, it changes the move, the move significantly. And then, yeah, so that's it for the Rumble Fruit. Um, if you guys have liked this video, uh, please like and subscribe. Thank you, know, you for watching. We always appreciate that. Also, we have a Discord. Feel free to join that if you guys want to know um, future updates for videos. Just kind of chat with people like Gonzo, people who help us out with our videos. And then, um, yeah, so thank you so much for watching. And have a great day. Have a great day. We'll see you guys next time.